WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. We've got sort of a green board out here. We've got the Dow up 12 points. S&P's up 7. NASDAQ is up 1 point. Uh, the Russell's up 10. Semis are up 18. Tranny's up 63. You've got gold trading up 2 bucks. Silver's off 9 cents. Light trade crude up 52 pennies. Trade at 82.82. Natural gas is... It's got the wrong contract in there. Give me a moment. Sorry about that. That's weird. I've changed it. I know I've changed it a few times. It's weird that it comes back. It's up 18 pennies. It's a nice move there. Trading out at 354. And the 30 year Treasury up uh, about a half a point, trading at 109.25. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini, upper left hand side. We've got a TD9 count bottom pattern. We've got a Rhodes Mintum indicator bottom. We've got a new profile that did take hold. Support is at 4146. Resistance is at either 4244 or 4317. I expect we'll get up to the 4244 level. Spot volatility trading below yesterday's low. That's bullish for the SP 500. So that again should make that move up to the 4244 level. In the case of the NQ, it's got a TD9 count uh, bottom out there. It does have a new profile. It's bearish in structure. The resistance zone is between 14,838 and 14,938. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar index, it uh, found support at the bottom of that new profile yesterday. That's at 105.80, and now it's going to go target the top of that profile at 106.45. Gold also attempting now to form a new profile with resistance up at the uh, 2019-70 level and support at 1970-10. A close today above 2009-20 would negate its TD9 count top, but still would have to deal with that resistance up at 2019-70. That's assuming that the profile takes hold at day's end. If we take a look at silver, did close above the top of its profile yesterday. It does not have a top, but it does have resistance up at 23.92. Light Sweet Crew continues its consolidation with inside its profile. Price right now stuck in that bullish buy zone. That's between 81.43 and 83.88. Natural gas did test and reject the top of that swing point yesterday. That was the October 6th, October 3rd swing point, and it is most certainly taken off. If we take a look at the 30-year uh, treasury, a trade above the top of its profile, but what it's dealing with here is trend line resistance. That trend line resistance as, uh, well, today's high, we'll call that the trend line resistance point, 110.12. It might be just slightly above that, but that's the level that it has to deal with. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you're off to start your Tuesday, first have a happy Halloween, and uh, we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now. The reality.